The Stream Global Innovations held their sneaker ball fundraiser in the San Okita Valley this past weekend to help low-income students have the same opportunities in different career paths. Nimani Knight started her foundation, Stream Global Innovation, at the age of 13 with the help and support of her mom, Nakia Richards. Nimani started this because she has a passion to help people. Yeah, um, I was in an entrepreneur's program when I was 13, and the goal was to teach middle school students how to create a physical product to sell and to learn business principles. Um, instead of creating a physical product, I decided to create this platform for product makers, and it really just stems out of me wanting to give access to the kids in my community to something that we never saw before. So bringing companies and kids together was not the normal, so we tried to make it the normal. That's what Stream is. Her mother, Nakia Richards, helped the foundation grow immensely by gaining different connections. We work with some of the world's amazing companies like Google, Lockheed Martin, PPG, um, Amazons, and you name it, and even local companies here in Santa Cruz and beyond. Um, we had some people here from North Carolina where we work with businesses there. Atlanta, Georgia is another um, opportunity that we've done. Um, and I'm trying to think what else. Oh, Texas. Sorry, Texas. Texas. Uh, we work with both Dallas and Grand Prairie, Texas. By doing this, it encouraged her 13-year-old son, Amari Richards, to donate shoes this holiday season to children in need. So he asked if he could go into his bank account, or if I can go into his bank account, and get out $250 of his own money. And his goal was to go and buy Christmas toys for kids in need. So Stream for the Holiday was birthed from, really, Amari saying, I don't want a kid to go without. And so he went out and he did it, and then we partnered him with other people with like minds like California Highway Patrol and just generous donors like this to um, bring toys in. Reporting live for Kenya's News, I'm Charles Calvario.